Welcome to Remnant Online Followers. Please kindly subscribe. Thank you. The, the struggles that people encounter in their daily lives will be much more easier to bear if you could accept that you are going to be God's mouthpiece. You know what, what kind of encouragement you can be to the next person by your side just because you were able to tap into God's frequency and you understand his mind for the person in a current situation. God needs a mouthpiece. He needs a mouthpiece for individuals. He needs a mouthpiece for nations. He needs a mouthpiece. The Bible says that we are all capable of prophesying according to the investment of the grace of God that is upon our lives. Each and every one of us has an unction from the Holy Ones by which he can know things supernaturally. So you can know the mind of God. You can know what God is saying. You can know what is on the heart of God. It takes 35 seconds to hear God. It takes 35 seconds to hear. And I know you don't believe it, but... Um, James, can you, can you run a stopwatch? Because we want to time what we're doing. Run a stopwatch. Let's see how long it will take to secure the mind of God. You know, whenever we, we, we say, we, we are going to see God's face. Some people say, ah. Because they are seeing, trying to calculate the distance between earth and heaven. So, It's not that difficult. So I want to practicalize it right now. So the stopwatch, one, two, go. So we're going to pray now. It's already running. Can we pray? Yes. Now, this is how to, to secure the mind of God. As you are praying, maybe you came with your wife and you're sitting close to your wife, like my friend Henry. This is Laura, his beautiful wife. Forget about your wife for now. I know he can't do without his wife. He's always, hey, Laura, Jesus. <laughs> But you see, for now, you just let go, Laura. So forget about who is sitting by your side. And then empty your heart of all your cares. Make it light. And then let's, let's strike at the Lord. All right? Can we do that? Okay. Yes. Hey, you, you're all right? Start oh, starting. starting. Right. So that's what we're going to do. Then we'll find out how long it will take before we pick his mind. And in order for you to know that it is his mind, we'll ask him to do something, to prove it. I think that's okay. Yeah. Oh, it's not okay. So we'll cut it. We'll cut. We'll not ask him. Oh, we'll just, I, I, I need a response. I need a response from you. Okay? Oh, okay. Okay. All right. So we, we are well in a moment of time. And this is what you do. You just keep speaking in tongues. Make sure that nothing enters into your mind that is from this environment. Shield it from me shield it from James shield it and just exactly all right so let's let's try I just keep speaking in tongues if you need to close your eyes to achieve focus please do that please do that please do that I can't hear you I can't hear you I didn't say meditative meditative no I saw me he called Ebro bobo siko skata briga fantelia mesu ke prakos ke to bre barakos kabria taba bosha me aiko babanteli. In the name of Jesus. How many? In the name of Jesus. We have 20, 20, 29 seconds. Did you pick anything? Because I picked too many things. Okay, one thing. Okay, one thing. You have a hearing problem in one of your ears. I don't know what happened to you, but you you have a hearing problem in one of your ears. And sometimes you you can't you can't even take a call from that ear. You need to take your call on the other ear. Yeah. I'm trying to provoke you. Are you, are you seeing what I'm doing? I'm trying to provoke you. Can you come? Okay. Yeah. So I was born deaf in my right ear. So he, he was born deaf in which of the ears? The right one. The right one. Now, so um, can you, sorry, uh, I love you. Amen. Now, th th this is what you would do. Take your, this finger. Is there anybody coming in for this same thing? 
because you need to be following the instructions. Yeah, this this ear. All right, so this is what you do, and we don't need to do it too many times. Just one time, and everything will happen. Take this finger. Then you block the ear that cannot hear. Can you block it completely? If it's this way or this way. Block the ear that cannot hear completely. Are you still with me? All right. So, I want to pray in a moment and rebuke the deafening spirit. And let's see if... If, if yeah, you know, he, he may not hear. But, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I arrest every spirit of deafness deafening spirits be bound deafening spirit be bound come out of the ear come out of the ear in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus now I command you ear hear in Jesus name hear in Jesus name remove this finger put this finger block the one that can hear yeah those of you around them can you help help them test out that ear if they can hear if you can hear you let us know yeah yeah thank you now now listen listen okay sorry you can can you hear yes sir okay now, now listen i i i heard the lord speaking about a woman a woman here that has been having this pain on her right leg for a while pain there is this pain that you've been living with and the pain is on your right leg and the lord is saying that this morning is the morning for your healing so where's that woman you have this pain you've been managing on your right leg can you come no no clapping no clapping no clapping this is what all of us i'm just demonstrating what we should be doing every day every single day you come and say pastor mark the lord said this allow him to judge it if it's from the lord or not but you have done what you believe you were dispatched to do he needs a mouthpiece the bible says he was taken from prison he was taken from judgment who shall declare his generation i signed up i signed up to declare his generation to speak his kingdom to speak his power to speak his glory and many times I've done that and people felt mad about my guts. Who does he claim he is? That's no longer my business. I was just a mouthpiece and I, I said it the, the way it came. I did not edit it. I just released it. I'm not, I'm not responsible for the consequences. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. So we are going to pray with her. Okay. Um, what's, what's the situation? Oh my God. Do you know the power of God is on you? Yes. You, you, yes. Are you aware of that? Mm. Okay. So he's the one that spoke. And that's why the power is on her. You know, the, the power of God moves in the direction. Sister Laura, can you, can you help me? Okay. I don't want her falling on the ground. Okay. Now, the power of God moves in the direction, not the voice of God. So if you can pick the voice of God, then you can move in the power of God. See, you just ask the Lord to do the things that he told you about that's how power moves all right like okay we want to ask god now lord in the name of jesus can you stretch forth your hand and begin to touch my sister's body from the crown of her head to the soles of her feet and let that pain be taken away let that yoke be broken that your the weight of your glory might descend upon her in the name of jesus christ i ask so oh god that your mighty hand your holy ghost will come upon her so mightily i i break that yoke of pain upon her legs in the name of jesus you see I, I couldn't i couldn't i couldn't manipulate that I couldn't manipulate that the power of god goes in the direction of the voice of god okay no no one more time one more goes in the direction goes in the direction of yeah thank you for watching please kindly like comment subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you always get notified whenever we post a new video and don't forget to share thank you